I'm the disc golf guy. 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 And this is my video blog. I'm the disc golf guy and this is my video blog. I'm here at the USDGC at the moment and I am talking with Aaron Martin, the co-founder here of T-Box. Aaron, this is an idea just about everyone in disc golf has probably thought about, but well, it's all about the guys that act on it. So tell us about what you've done. Well, about a year and a half ago, we decided, this was an idea that came about about six years ago. And about a year and a half ago, we uh, were able to secure the funds to uh, start on our endeavor and we started R&D and we eventually ended up with this security shell um, and a vandal resistant um, so if you, you spray paint on it or put a permanent marker you can wipe it off with a wet rag and some solvent um, you got bulletproof uh, polycarbonate right here uh, for security it's connected to us if anybody shuts off the power it lets us know if anybody tries to break in it lets us know um, and they were made to be in low supervision in parks, right at hole one, for the convenience to bring in new players and for rec players and whoever else needs a disc, they can get them right there at hole one. And that's, it, yeah. it's, it's definitely awesome because, mm -hmm. like you said, if you just bring the disc right to the park where there's not commonly pro shops, Somebody can walk right up and they can make their purchase and they can start playing. It looks like it holds a pretty good amount of discs. Looks like it's got five columns, three, or I'm sorry, three rows, five columns, uh, 15 and what, 13 Th deep? 13 deep, 195 total. Oh, shoot, I was going to do the math. Man. Okay, <laughs> uh, I, I add up too many strokes. I can't do that kind of math. <laughs> so um, it's awesome because then you can separate it, whether it's a club or a municipality, they can separate it. Uh, and put them all in there as needed, drivers, putters, mid-range, so on and so forth. Mm -hmm. And then for the most part, it accepts credit and debit cards. Is that the is Cre that the way it goes? Credit card, debit cards, and mobile devices. Okay, yeah. and then um, is there anything else that people should know about the machine? I mean, like well, I said, it seems like you got it ready for a park and it yeah. seems like it can be connected wirelessly right. so everybody knows what's going on with it, prints yeah. out sales uh, numbers and it gives you guys all that kind of information. Yeah. Yeah. Seems like you guys thought of everything. Well. We're, we hope that we've thought of everything we can for the time <laughs> being, but we're on, you know, we learn as we go and we're flexible and that's the most important thing when you're an entrepreneur. Very um, cool. Uh, tbox.com is the place to check it out. That's two E's and two X's. Too many X's can be a problem. Anyway, two E's and two X's, tbox.com. If you step aside, I think I'm gonna get myself my, my disc with my uh, card here. Does that sound good? Sounds great. All right, all you'd have to do is take either a credit or debit card, something like this, or your gift card from T-Box. Boom, swipe it. Come on over here. I think I want myself a nice, tasty DX Rock, maybe number 38. And served right up is my very nice Rock. All right, well, there you have it. That is Aaron Martin. This is T-Box. I'm the Disc Golf Guy. Go out, purchase yourself a brand new disc. He's the Disc Golf Guy, and that was his video blog.